The movie is called Joe's Violin. I'd love for you to tell me about your friend Joe and who he is. He's a 94-year-old Holocaust survivor who decided to donate his violin to the WQXR instrument drive because he stopped playing on the violin and he wanted someone to continue on his legacy and to continue playing on his violin. Can you show us this violin that traveled with, with Joseph all this way? And there's a moment in, in the film where you talk about all of the secrets and all of the stories that that violin has contained. It's a privilege because I get to have history in my hands. And I've, to me, this is like an adventure. I always wanted an adventure. We knew that Brianna would appreciate um, playing on Joseph's violin and, and, you know, we couldn't be prouder of her and, um, you know, how much she's progressed playing as a musician and also just, you know, being the first recipient of Joseph's violin. Well, this is really a film about connection and about two people born 80 years apart on different continents who have something in common, who form this friendship. Brianna, what is the message that you hope people take from this film? That they can be connected even through an object, no matter where they come from, their background, their issues, anything. There is some type of connection you have with the stranger you walk with. You have a connection with that person, whether you want to admit it or not, and whether you like it or not.